guys, welcome back. I'm Ali. <laughs> um, I am a Brit who lives in Australia who really likes clothes and makeup and I have not necessarily got the best taste and or ability in either of those arenas, but here we are doing it anyway. <laughs> okay, so today I have City Chic haul. City Chic is a plus size fashion brand in Australia. Hey, can we not manicure on the couch? Before I was so rudely interrupted by the grooming marathon, which is still happening on the floor. Molly, City Chic is an Australian plus size brand. They have really, really lovely, fashionable, well made clothes, in my opinion. This video is not sponsored. I just really like their stuff. Uh, just before Christmas, I ordered um, a few pieces that um, I could wear over the festive period to look pretty, um, despite the fact I have many, many, <laughs> I'll put videos here and here that you can see, um, many, many outfits that could have been worn for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, etc. But, I like stuff, okay? <laughs> anyway. I am wearing the jeans from this haul. They are black, they have a frayed bottom, and they are the Harley High Rise, I think. I will bring up my order. They're actually the Angel Flare jeans. Um, I actually thought they were going to be, yeah, boot cut ones. Anyway, um, they're the Angel Flare jeans, and they're high rise, it says so on the tag, it doesn't say on the name though. Um, and they have, I think, five buttons up the front, so they're right up my street. If you've seen my Fashion Nova haul, you know I like a high-rise pair of jeans that flare out because I have really chunky thighs. I like to balance it out with a flare. Um, these ones, I got in an 18 because the last time I did a city chic haul, I got some skinny jeans, you know, ripped skinny jeans, and I was concerned, so I got them in a 20, because that's generally my bottom size. Um, but after about 10 minutes of wearing them, as soon as you get up and start walking around, they start falling down. They're way too big in the butt and waist for me. So I sized down and I was like, oh God, are they actually gonna fit? Because they're a different cut, they're a different style, and we know how that goes. <laughs> these fit perfectly there is a slight tightness around my waist which gives me the middle squidge but we can deal with it <laughs> that's that's jeans it's jeans that's what happens when you wear jeans you get rolls um especially when you have rolls um these are chef's kiss fit they're so comfortable they're thick denim as well so like i really love the ones i got from fashion over but the denim is very thin it doesn't last very long these feel like they're going to last a lot longer um they were 59.97 down from probably about to a hundred dollars however i used honey you know the extension thing that everyone raves up i used honey on the computer and i got an additional 17.99 off so they cost 42 bucks in the end um that is perfectly reasonable for a pair of jeans which is very thick and fits really well um i feel like i'm gonna get quite a lot of wear out of them before anything ever happens to them they do come in other colors but not all of them are priced the same for whatever reason I don't know. Okay, so with the jeans, yeah, let's address the extremely hairy elephant in the room. I was wearing this uh, fringe fever jacket in black. And this jacket has been advertised to me on Facebook over and over and over again. And there's only so many times I can go, no, I don't need a jacket that does this. <laughs> I feel like I'm an extra on Sesame Street. It's not very thick. Look, it's got it's it's like netting, um, which has the the fringy stuff weaved into it. Um, so it's not hugely thick. It's like it's not a massive fur coat, but it does look really funny. And Molly finds it adorable and hilarious. She thinks I'm now her or something. I don't know. She just is, is obsessed. The only thing I will say is that a it's not very like it's not very big. I could have done with a size up. I got an 18, so I could have done with a 20. It does do up at the middle. It does not it 
does it up at the bottom, but it's quite tight. There's no give in it whatsoever. Um, so I could have done with a 20 maybe in this one, but it still looks cute and it looks fun. And I don't think I'd ever do it up anyway more than this one. So, eh. <laughs> eh. Um, but I also don't like the fact that it is hook and eye closures. Um, because this is a mesh fabric and the hook and eye closures catch in the mesh fabric all the time. So you're trying to put it on and it's like fucking caught on itself. Um, but it's cute and it's fun and like wearing it over like a sparkly shirt or something would be quite funny. Um, this was $50. Again, saved $15, so it's $35. It was not $50 to start with. Um, it was $129.95. $129 $129.95 to start with, definitely wouldn't have bought it for that price and would be very disappointed to have paid over $100 for something quite thin, but 35 bucks here all day for it. Fun, looks funny. <laughs> I think it looks really cool. <laughs> uh, yeah, and it makes you giggle. So um, for 35 bucks, yes. The other jacket I got that I teamed with these um, pants is a... Opulent, no, piping praise jacket in black. Again, probably could have done with a 20 instead of an 18, but it does fit and it does look very cute. Um, it's got really nice structured shoulder with a bit of a puff sleeve on it. And it's got a cute little puffy sleeve there and a piping that goes all the way down the front and round and down the back. I love the shape that the back gives, it's really lovely, and the fabric is stretchy, but it's not, not hugely stretchy, so it's not quite stretchy enough, it's a really nice cropped jacket, you could wear this to work if you wanted to, um, I don't work in an office, so I have absolutely no intention of wearing it to work, it doesn't have a lapel, it just has a flat collar, but it's very cute, nonetheless. Um, and yeah, it's a very heavy material, so it's probably better for winter. This one originally was $99.95, so 100 bucks, And I got it for 50 no. $48.98, so $49. Um, I have no idea what coupon code I used. I just used the Honey extension, and it typed in a really random, like, string of information into uh, the coupon code box, and... I got a bunch of money off, which I wasn't mad about. So, just get get the Honey extension. I'm I'm just bummed that I can't shop on my phone and use the Honey extension. They really need to figure out how to do that extension for Android and that stuff because I want it on my phone, man. Anyway, okay. So that's the jackets and my jeans. Okay, this is the dress I wore on Christmas Eve. Um, it's a dark blue with pretty flowers, and it is a Florence dress in navy, and this one, it says dress, but again, because I have a long torso, it's not quite long enough for me, so I did wear it with leggings underneath, um, just because it just literally hits just like a little bit too short for me in any way, shape, or form. Even though I would have just worn tights anyway, uh, because my legs are gross and look like fucking hams. Um, I love the sleeve, really cute. It, it was slightly tight on my upper arm, but of course it was. <laughs> Fat arms. <laughs> um, I got it in 18. It was slightly tight on my upper arms. However, if I'd have sized up, it would have gaped really badly across my bust. It was only just tight enough across my bust anyway. Um, so if it, yeah, if I'd have sized up to a 20, it would have been out here somewhere, you know. So I'm glad I got it in, in the 18. And it comes with a cute belt, which is removable. And this actually comes out in about 12 different fabrics on their website, this cut. So if you like it, but don't like this colour or this style. There's a really nice red one, there's a pink one, all sorts. And I think there's a couple of plain ones as well if you're not into flowers, etc. So this cut is all over their website. It's a very flattering cut and it's very cute. Um, that one 
I started out $90 and I got it for $64. So, pretty good. Okay. I... This black dress I feel like is a miss for me. Uh, this is the Opulent Elegant... No, Opulent Elbow Sleeve Dress. And it looked really cute in the pictures, but... When it arrived, it just kind of looked like the fabric looks kind of cheap. And just ain't it, fam. <laughs> you know, just it's just not it. Yeah, it's just a plain, like it's a plain black, um, fake wrap dress, I guess. Um, but it's got like the fabric is. It feels kind of cheap, and it looks really creased. Like I have no idea how I would get the creases out of this. It's not the kind of. It feels like the kind of fabric that would probably melt if you tried to iron it. Um, I like the elbow sleevey thing and I and it's got a slightly puffed shoulder which is cute but there's an odd lining from the waist down which hits in a very different fashion to the rest of the dress it's quite a narrow lining and it comes down so far that you can see it because it's got a you know a scalloped edge at the bottom so you can see the lining through the you know where the where the bottom kind of goes out that the lining is in the gap it's like that's not how it's supposed to look is it um so this one is not great for me i'm i think it looked okay but there are things wrong with it that i don't really like it could i don't know I think it, my most my biggest issue with this one is the lining inside it's just eh. um and also, how the hell do you get all of it? Look at that crease. Can you see that creasing? How do you get that out of this kind of fabric? Do I need a steamer? Because I'm not buying a steamer. This is why I expected a little bit more from this dress. It was $130 to start with. Um, so I expected nicer fabric than this for that price point. Um, I did get it for $54.58, which means it was heavily discounted. And that probably should have been a giveaway in hindsight but <laughs> but it wasn't um yeah it's it's an okay dress i like the shape of it i don't like the lining or the fabric that it's made of and you know means i won't wear it okay this last one <sighs> they have this in so many colors on their website you would not believe there is a color to suit every last one of us on of this dress i swear i promise that literally everyone can have this dress. This is the colour wrap dress in teal. It is absolutely not a wrap dress in any way. Uh, it is very cute and it's got this, this going on here at the side which it looks kind of weird in the picture and you're like, why does it look like that? And it is teal, it's showing up quite blue on the camera, but it is very much more green than it's showing up. And it's got this cute belt that comes with it. And it's got an elasticated bit across the back as well. So there's a bit of give there. Again, it's a little, like it is a mini dress. So for this one, definitely for me, I would be wearing tights and or leggings under it, but it's so cute. And it made me go, oh my God, this is so cute when I put it on, when I looked. And I wished I'd worn it for Christmas Eve as soon as I put it on. Um, this was $99.95. I paid $41.97 for it. And as soon as I put it on yesterday, I immediately went and ordered it in a different colour. So now I'm going to have two. <laughs> um, the belt is hugely stretchy. This is all elastic. And this is how big the belt is. When I put it on, I didn't realise this is actually still kimbled together. <laughs> and I still managed to wear this belt because that's how like it's all elastic <laughs> so it probably looks kind of weird at the back if I don't know if I show the back that much but yeah it, it... <laughs> um yeah this is my absolute favorite piece from this haul it is so cute it is so flattering and yeah it comes in so many colors and they have also have ones with um glitter on the belt as well if you want a bit more of a glitzy look um yeah i can't stress how cute and flattering this is <laughs> i don't know if, if i'm talking bullshit and i see it later i'm gonna be like oh damn it i thought i looked cute 
Molly is just constantly licking her foot at the moment. I don't know whether she did the stung or something. She's driving me insane. Anyway, I had so much fun with this City Chic haul. I bought a bunch more stuff yesterday. Um, they are having a 30% off sale. And also, again, the discount code sat on top of that again. Uh, that the This order for i think was it six six pieces yeah six pieces that came to four hundred dollars but i got a 122 dollar discount so in the end it cost me 280 dollars for the six pieces which given the quality of everything except the black dress <laughs> i'm more than happy with given the generosity of their sizing i would always err on the side of sizing down a little bit because yeah like I said I'm always a 20 in jeans when I buy them from anywhere else or a 4x if I buy from Shein um and pants <laughs> yeah I'm always, I'm always a 20 or is, is it US 16 um but from here this is these are an 18 easy okay anyway that's my overdue Christmas city chic haul <laughs> Yeah, I know this jacket's very exciting, but can you just sit down? <laughs> sit down. I know you think it's like... <laughs> Molly, Molly, you need to sit. You need to sit. You need to sit. You need to sit. Okay, yeah, that's it. Okay, very good. I know this jacket's very exciting. The grooming marathon, which is still happening on the floor. Molly, 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 leave your foot alone. I thought I looked cute. Molly, can you stop that? It's just constant. Everybody, can you feel the